Hello, welcome back to AJM Learn. Today, going to update this one. Um, we get lots of comments and questions on the drop down menu post, um, and it was time for an update because as Squarespace releases their own stuff, it kind of breaks CSS sometimes. So, all right, I'm going to paste this in directly from the post. Actually, let me go back. Just a reminder of how boring the drop down is. And I will just paste it directly in and talk through it real quick. So the padding, as you can see, everything's a little more spaced out, which is nice. You can, of course, adjust this as needed. Um, the background and font color. So this is right here, this background and font color. So not the hover. This first one's just the color here. Next is the hover. So you can set the background and the font color here. Next, um, this removes the active nav underline. So let me go to one of these drop-down pages. There's nothing on it. Typically, so without this, there would be, of course, it's not going to do it, but if I refresh, there would be an underline under this drop dropdown. Um, so let's put that back. And then same here. This one down here removes the nav within a drop down. So if you're on an active page, it would typically be underlined, and now it's not. Um, this is a little, as you can see, like here on the home page, it's looking great. And then as I jump over to this page, just note, like, so for example, on the homepage here, I probably have the theme color is set to something dark. So my font is kind of following that. Um, if you go to like over here, I'm on a lighter theme or no theme, just make sure sometimes these fonts, all I'm trying to say is all these, sometimes these fonts do get a little bit like finicky. So sometimes you do, if you're finding that it just will not do what you want it to do, you can always throw an important tag in here and see, it'll do it. So, and then this one wanted to follow suit. So, so yeah, based on like your background colors, if it starts doing funky stuff, throw that important tag in there. Um, and then last note. So in my, our old post, um, I had a piece of code that allowed, like, basically changed it to where you couldn't click on the folder title. So, like, the word drop down. I took that out because Squarespace, it doesn't do that anymore. I'm trying to click right now and it's going to take me in edit mode, but like, it doesn't work. So, no need for that piece. Um, all right. Hope this helps. Hope you enjoy.